Uh, Senator Graham, thank you for hosting this. Thank you for continuing to bring attention to this. And thank you to all the gentlemen behind me who continue to work diligently to actually secure our border. That's what the American people deserve. But unfortunately, Joe Biden refuses to give that to them. You know, when we look at this emergency supplemental, when we look at this national security supplemental, when we look at what Joe Biden sent us, he put money for the border in there. But do you know what that was? It was stuff that continues to facilitate the mass migration that we see across our border. It was yet more of a magnet to draw more and more people here. Now I wanna tell you who benefits from that because we have both a national security and a humanitarian crisis on our border. The liberal media has decided to turn a blind eye to the fact that women are being raped on our border, that children are being recycled on our border, that we have laws that allow that to happen and actually that that's what some of these children are going through. Guys, when are you gonna actually call it like it is and not like the liberal left wants you to? The reality is these policies are inhumane. You look at the national security threat of this. Yo, we've gone through a week where we had 10,000 come over the border, 10,000 come over the border, 12,000, an all-time high. And to what Senator Thune said, Secretary Jay Johnson under President Obama said 1,000 a day would be a crisis. We're hitting 12. We must secure our border for the safety and security of the American people. I don't want to sit across from another mama who lost their child to fentanyl poisoning. You know, I, I don't want to look out and, and see the travesty that occurs as a result of this. And at the end of the day, when we're putting policies in place to ensure that we have national security, the first among all of these must be the border. And y'all need to wake up because Senator Graham asked the questions yesterday. He asked Director Ray about this. He said, I've never seen a time, this is the response, Dr. Director Ray, I've never seen a time where all the threats or so many of the threats are all elevated at exactly the same time. He followed up with, I see blinking lights everywhere I turn. He said a heightened threat environment from foreign terrorist organizations and obviously the ability to exploit, point, exploit ports of entry, including our Southwest border. Senate Democrats and President Joe Biden are putting the American people last. We need to make sure we create deterrence. We need to make sure we, we create safety and we must do more for the people here at home. They deserve it. And that is exactly what we are going to continue to fight for.